Hello, this is Andre Battles of How and Why, the Bible Answer Guy, with another devotional from our book, Jesus Calling for April the 2nd. Jesus has promised to meet all of your needs. Jesus has promised to meet all of your needs according to his riches in glory. Your deepest, most constant need is to be in constant communication with Jesus. Jesus has planted peace in the garden of your heart where he lives. There are weeds growing there, pride, selfishness, disbelief, but Jesus is the gardener and he is working to uproot these weeds. Jesus does his work in various ways. When you sit quietly with him, he shines the light of his presence directly in your heart. In the light of Jesus's presence, peace begins to grow and weeds shrivel up. Jesus also sends trials in the midst of your life. When you trust Jesus in the midst of your trouble, the weeds die out and peace begins to flourish. Thank Jesus for troublesome situations. The peace that they endure far outweighs the trials that they bring. Our scripture reading today is from Philippians 4, 19. And my God shall supply all of your needs according to his glorious riches in Christ Jesus. A line from today's devotional says that Jesus has planted peace in the garden of your heart where he lives. However, there are also weeds there, pride, selfishness, and disbelief. And that was very powerful. You know, we don't look at it that way, but that's exactly what pride, selfishness, lust, anger, frustration, despair, thoughts of suicide is. It is a weed. These are weeds. And they are there to snuff out the peace that God has given you. You know, we've got to be gardeners just like Christ is. Christ comes into the heart when we invite him and he weeds out all of the things that don't look like him and that do not align with his presence. But we've got to be co-laborers with Christ. We've got to help him weed out all of the things in our lives that don't look like him. You can't get to heaven and much less be peaceful while you're on this earth with pride. You can't get to heaven, much less be peaceful on this earth with jealousy, selfishness, envy, or lust. Allow Jesus to come in and weed out all the things out of your heart that don't belong. How do you do that? You pray with me. Father in heaven, I invite you into my heart. I need you to do the weeding out of everything that does not look like you. I am going to be willing and I'm going to be obedient to your spirit and allow you to do the work in me that must be done. In Jesus' precious name I pray, amen. But well, once again, this is Andre Battles with another devotional from our book, Jesus Calling. Look, we've been having a great time in the prayer line and all you gotta do is comment amen and I will get the information as to what time, what days, which is every day, but what time and how you can get there. So just type in amen and I'll get that to you. And by God's grace, I'll see you right here tomorrow.